What is the most amazing trick you've ever seen? What amazed you about it? Why do you think that people say that they can't believe their eyes? Let's see if we can figure it out from today's Bible story. Two days later, there was a wedding in the town of Cana in Galilee. Jesus' mother was there, and Jesus and his disciples had also been invited to the wedding. When the wine had been given out, Jesus' mother said to him, They are out of wine. You must not tell me what to do, Jesus replied. My time has not yet come. Jesus' mother told the servants, Do whatever he tells you. The Jews have rules about ritual washing, and for this purpose, six stone water jars were there, each one large enough to hold between 20 and 30 gallons. Jesus said to the servants, Fill these jars with water. They filled them to the brim, and then he told them, Now draw some water out and take it to the man in charge of the feast. They took him the water, which had now been turned into wine, and he tasted it. He did not know where this wine had come from, but of course the servants who had drawn the water knew. So he called the bridegroom and he said to them, Everyone serves the best wine first, and then after the guests have drunk a lot, they serve the ordinary wine. But you have kept the best wine until now. Jesus performed his first miracle in Cana in Galilee. There he revealed his glory and his disciples believed in him. And that's today's big idea. Jesus gives us a taste of God's power. And God's power is so great that it can be hard to imagine how truly great it is. When Jesus was on earth, Jesus was filled with God's power and performed many amazing miracles that people got to witness, just like the one at the wedding. Because again, Jesus gives us a taste of God's power.